That is the sales golem of the Daedalus blacksmith. It's a masterwork created by my darling sister Elena. If you need to purchase any weapons made by Elena, or have any tools that need fixing, just speak to the golem. Oh, how rude of me. I haven't properly introduced myself. My name is James. I'm a merchant, making my living from commerce to and from the island. You got up. Shut up, you jerk! I'm up already! I'm going to punch you in the face if you come in here! <laughs> My shy and quiet little sister can be quite a handful. Goodbye! Thank you. Hmm. Thank you.
Yeah. Yeah. I see. Thank you.
James! James! Yeah. <sighs> but... Actually, uh, I've split up with my girlfriend. What? You split up? Well, to be honest, she dumped me. Why? What happened? The way she tells it, because I didn't go and see her enough. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to start by working hard and becoming the kind of businessman that will make her head spin. Ha! And I've still got my dear sister in my corner. I'll be okay. Woo! <laughs> 
Yeah. Thank you. Nice work. Thank you. Something I picked up from one of my contacts. I was going to give it to my girlfriend, but I'd like you to have it. You, the ones who pulled me back from the brink. Thank you. But... Morning. You're looking well today. Okay. Okay. 
Thank you. This job has totally fallen apart. I was only told the horses were all wiped out. I didn't get it confirmed by anyone else. Perhaps the whole accident was faked. Thank you. I feel like you've pointed me towards a way out of this mess. Really? I'm so glad. It's all thanks to you. I'm going to act immediately. Thanks again. See you. It 
Father's been acting strangely recently. He's definitely been worried about something. But he's even been leaving me alone. Not that I mind that so much. Thank you.
hold it, sis. It almost sounds like you're happier about this than I am. You really do love your big brother, don't you, sister dear? <laughs> you couldn't be more wrong. I'm just happy someone has finally come along who can take you off my hands, you dunce. <laughs> you're so shy, Elena. I said you're wrong! No, we're not. You're the number one in my heart. Elena's number two. Okay, okay, I know. I'm still a little jealous of just how well you two get along. You are wrong! We aren't close at all. He just clings on to me all the time. Kiss you. Would that be okay? No, I'm sorry. I rushed into things, didn't I? Without thinking about you. We can take things at a slower pace. I love you. No. I'm just embarrassed all of a sudden. This is all so... Hi, I've been wanting to see you.
So, where shall we go? How about we take a walk down to the docks? destination. If it's close by, it should only take a day or so. But it can take a month or longer to reach farther towns. A month? Wow. That's a long time to spend on a boat. What do you do while you're on a boat? I usually read or go over my books for work. But since I'm always sailing somewhere for business, I quickly run out of new books to read. That's when you have to get out and meet the other people on board. <laughs> A lot of people feel like that. People who like to spend most of their time indoors. But on board, they always end up coming out of their cabins after a few days. It just gets too boring. I find it to be. When you're on a boat, you're riding with so many different people that you get to hear all kinds of stories. Merchants such as myself love things that mix our hobbies with the ability to make a profit. I'd love to go on a trip by boat with you someday. <laughs> that sounds like fun. Ah, uh, yes. Before I forget, I brought this today. What is it? It's a telescope. A telescope? Yeah, it allows you to see things that are very far away. For example, let's see. Oh, that boat over there. That boat is merely a speck on the horizon, but if you look at it through the telescope... Oh, it looks so big. 
It's great, isn't it? It's wonderful. It seems like I could see just about anything with this. <laughs> you might not be able to see everything, but lookouts in the boats can use these to spot islands quickly. One of my customers asked me to get them one, but uh, I wanted to show you first. Thank you so much. Of course. If I can't just come out and say what I want to say, then I fail as a merchant. Here goes. You and I, we're, uh, boyfriend and girlfriend, right? And, uh... Do you have strong feelings for me? Uh, I'm sorry. This is cowardly. I should just come right out and say it. That's why, um... I want you to marry me. I want you to be my wife. I love you. I love you more than anyone else. With my love, I can protect you from any hardship. I'm sure of it. That's why... I want you to marry me. Could you tell me your answer, please? Goodness, that was more nerve-wracking than any trade negotiation I've ever been part of. But thank you. Please, take this. It's an engagement ring, meant to signify a promise to the person you want to spend the rest of your life with. Would you do me the honor of allowing me to place this on your finger? What do you think? Pretty, isn't it? <laughs> You're tough to please. Does that mean you've seen fall colors that were even prettier than we have here? If so, I'd love for you to show me some time. Until then, this will have to serve as the best fall scenery I've witnessed. 
maybe before then, I'll be able to get my hands on that device that turns what you see into pictures. I thought you'd say that. I've been to many different lands in my travels for work, but I've never found anywhere with fall colors that could rival what we have here. Every year when this season comes around, I mourn the fact that I have no talent for painting. I can see why you'd want to record those beautiful colors in a picture. But I've heard that there's a device that can turn what you see into a picture automatically. It's just a rumor. Even so, I'd still like to have something like that someday. <laughs> but if something like that existed, then painters would find themselves out of work. <laughs> Come to think of it, I guess you're right. Of course. If I can't just come out and say what I want to say, then I fail as a merchant. Here goes. You and I, we're, uh, boyfriend and girlfriend, right? And, uh... Do you have strong feelings for me? I I I'm, uh, of course, I, I like you a lot. In fact, I I'm in love with you. That's why, um, I want you to marry me. I want you to be my wife. I love you. I love you more than anyone else. With my love, I can protect you from any hardship. I'm sure of it. That's why... I want you to marry me. Could you tell me your answer, please? Goodness, that was more nerve-wracking than any trade negotiation I've ever been part of. But thank you. Please, take this. It's an engagement ring, meant to signify a promise to the person you want to spend the rest of your life with. Would you do me the honor of allowing me to place this on your finger? Where shall we go? During this season, the church is probably our best bet. How pretty. I'm 
glad you noticed. I procured these decorations for Gerard so he could decorate the church. So, you selected these decorations then, James? Yeah, that's usually how it is. Every year I worry over which decorations to get, but this year people seem happy with what I picked. thought I put into the decorations, they can't compete with the snow. No matter what people do, they just can't match the beauty of nature. That's true. But I also think one of the wonderful things about people is that they have the capacity to appreciate that beauty. D d do you really think so? I do. Of course, the snow is pretty, but the decorations are even prettier. The decorations are beautiful, but they still can't compare with the snow. Thank you for saying such wonderful things. Of course. If I can't just come out and say what I want to say, then I fail as a merchant. Here goes. You and I, we're, uh, boyfriend and girlfriend, right? And, uh... Do you have strong feelings for me? Uh, I'm sorry. This is cowardly. I should just come right out and say it. That's why, um... I want you to marry me. I want you to be my wife. What? I love you. I love you more than anyone else. With my love, I can protect you from any hardship. I'm sure of it. That's why... I want you to marry me. Could you tell me your answer, please? Oh, thank goodness. That was more nerve-wracking than any trade negotiation I've ever been part of. But thank you. Please, take this. It's an engagement ring. Meant to signify a promise to the person you want to spend the rest of your life with. Would you do me the honor of allowing me to place this on your finger?
Would you look at that? The flowers this year are blooming splendidly. Would you like to walk with me a bit? Incredible! Cherry blossoms, no matter where you turn. It's like we're in a world of nothing but cherry blossoms. It really is. I had no idea there was a place like this so close to home. It's nice to take it easy like this, every once in a while. I really only feel like this when you're by my side. Sorry, I didn't mean for it to come out like that. But it's how I truly feel. How can I put it? It's like having my cake and eating it too. James, I don't think you're using that phrase properly. Uh, aren't I? Yeah. When I'm working, I'm usually fairly eloquent. But at times like this, I... Just get tongue-tied. James? What's been on your mind lately? You seem kind of... fidgety. Uh, uh, um... How do I put this? Of course. If I can't just come out and say what I want to say, then I fail as a merchant. Here goes. You and I, we're, uh, boyfriend and girlfriend, right? And, uh... Do you have strong feelings for me? I I'm, uh, of course, I, I like you a lot. In fact, I I'm in love with you. That's why, um, I want you to marry me. I want you to be my wife. I love you. I love you more than anyone else. With my love, I can protect you from any hardship. I'm sure of it. That's why... I want you to marry me. Could you tell me your answer, please? Thank goodness. That was more nerve-wracking than any trade negotiation I've ever been part of. But thank you. Please, take this. It's an engagement ring. Meant to signify a promise to the person you want to spend the rest of your life with. Would you do me the honor of allowing me to place this on your finger?
I do. Congratulations! Congratulations. 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 <laughs> Very nice. Congratulations! Congratulations! <laughs> Thank you! 
you, everyone. I'm so glad I was able to stay here in this time. I'm so happy right now. This looks delicious. Hmm. Here's an idea. Since you made it specially, would you mind feeding it to me? Um. Good morning. You look lovely as usual today. It's probably time for us to start a family. What's the best way to raise our kid? Uh, I can't wait to figure all that out. but I'm forbidding you from fighting monsters or using weapons. Other than that, you may continue all your normal activities. In fact, I'd like you to make sure you get exercise. And your husband should make sure he's not putting any extra stress on you. And I want you to be extra nice to her. Congratulations! I'm so happy for you two. I'm hoping for your baby's safe delivery. Thank you so much. We're happy. 
having a baby. I'll work hard, so you focus on the baby. Finally, parents! Thank you. Oh, look. We have an adorable baby girl. And such a cute one, too. Are you going out? Always so early. I should take inspiration from your example. Well, I'll see you when you get home. 